Hey guys, this is Mega Monkeys. I wanted to show you a couple of tools here inside of Cinema 4D that will help you give uh, information and give you a nice productive workflow right within your viewport. So um, you can see I've got all these things around that just give me information, things that I'd want to know, and there's more things that you can add that I've decided not to. The first thing is one that you probably mostly know about. Um, is the interactive render region which you can activate by uh, going under your render options and going to interactive render region and what it does is it just automatically updates in the area that you select I've got global illumination on so it's slower than normal but it goes at a fairly low quality so it'll update pretty quickly um, like generally it'll be close to instant and you can uh, like resize it to to best suit your uh, whatever you're working on so you can keep working quickly you don't have to keep doing full renders just to just to see um, just to see how things are going um, but something that I've just found out more found out about more recently is all of these uh, extra things on your HUD and your uh, viewport and how you access that is uh, by pressing shift V and it'll give you uh, all these options you can also go under edit in your uh, in your view and going to configure and uh, it gives you all of these options and most of these are uh, are available in other forms along along these menus in the view um, but what I've found useful is this HUD option at the end um, and there are lots of uh, things that you can turn on uh, like here I've got camera distance which you can see here distance that's the distance from the camera to uh, to my object whatever I have selected um, which is very very useful um, and I've got total objects, uh, which is over here, as well as the selected objects, um, the uh, total number of polygons and number of selected polygons. And I was looking for a way to do this for a long time because, like, if you want to know before I had to go Control I, which is good. It tells you how many points and polygons, objects. That's good information, but you can't click anywhere else you can't leave it open which is really annoying so that's this is the way to get around that and all this information is the statistics and that gives you uh, more specifically like tries quads lines points um, which uh, which is good um, although it's important to note that it's only how many are in your are in your view not the uh, not the total. There might be a way to to change that, but I haven't found it yet. Um, and there is up here. I have the object name and parent object. So here I've got my editable cube. So it shows me that's what I'm working on. Because sometimes, uh, like I try and do a loop cut and realize I haven't selected selected the right thing because I'm cluts like that. And then the parent, which I don't know maybe isn't the most useful thing but like, just get to know um, and then here I've got uh, active uh, tool active tool there it is and uh, so it just tells me what I'm working on it's basically the same thing as up here but it's nice that it's right in your in your uh, view and it's cool because also if you click then you get your previously used uh, tools just like if you go here. Um, distance I already covered, uh, frames per second of my of my view, how often it updates. Uh, good to know for um, performance. Uh, there are other things here that I haven't used, like camera, that one would be useful. Um, so if I go into my camera, it lets me know uh, which one I'm using. That could uh, definitely be useful. Um, and frame number and that's mostly it
also um, here you've got more options for how these things look uh, like opacity colors and that kind of thing um, and yeah I think that's it for this video I hope uh, hope you found this useful I definitely did um, it's nice also sorry um, you can also make it vertical um, if that helps you that's probably didn't need to go back to that but I did so thanks for watching uh, I hope this helps you definitely it's gonna help me in the future and thanks for watching so goodbye